So, proceeding to the next question, question number 170. In the reaction, this is ethane, conditions are given sodium amide in liquid ammonia, second reactant is CH3 CH2 Br. Reaction product is X, again reaction of sodamide in liquid ammonia and then treatment with ethyl bromide, product is Y. In this question, we have to find X and Y, the four options are given. So, let us try the question. This compound is ethyl. First step reaction is reaction with sodamide in liquid ammonia. Sodamide is a strong base and ethyne is acidic in nature. So, there will be loss of proton and formation of acetylide ion. Now, second step is the second reactant given is CH3CH2Br. When such type of ion reacts with CH3CH2Br, the product form is HC triple bond C. This is CH2CH3. So, this is the compound X. Now, again the same sequence of reaction is repeated. So, next time this proton will be released and this ethyl group will be substituted at the triple bonded carbon atom. So, final product of reaction is this one. This is X, this is Y. Now, let us name the compound. The first compound X is 1, 2, 3, 4. Total 4 carbon atom is present and triple bond is present at the first carbon atom. So, this compound is but 1 ion. Now, in second Y, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, this compound is hexane in which carbon carbon triple bond is present at third carbon. So, this is hex 3 ion. So, in the given option, second option is the correct one. X is 1 butyne while Y is 3 hexane. So, correct answer is second option. So, moving to the next question which is question number 171. Consider the following liquid vapor equilibrium. Liquid in equilibrium with vapor which of the following relation is correct and four relationship is given. Liquid and vapor whenever exist in dynamic equilibrium with each other, we can apply their clausius clapeyron equation. And in this case, the clausius clapeyron equation formula is given in the first option. So, this is formula based question and first option is the correct one. This is correct answer. 